I am back. Hello guys, welcome to another video. Now, this is Windows XP. We all know that Windows XP support ended back in 2014 and programs have lost its support for this operating system. But in this, in this virtual machine, there is a cat. I actually installed one core API. Now you might wonder what is that? Well, one core API works like an extended kernel for Windows XP, kind of like an Windows Vista extended kernel, but on Windows XP. The setup process is easy, but as you see here, I'm on a virtual machine, and you ask, why did you try it on a hardware system? Well, I tried, but I couldn't boot many times I actually got it to work once and even then it was the most unstable experience I had in a Windows operating system um, so these are the files that you need and before I do a tutorial on this I want to show you what it can do as we all know Zoom here only support Windows 7 and up but if you go and click it here it will actually work you can you see the sign in unfortunately I can't sign in or search something in Google because I don't have the internet connected on this virtual machine but you get the point here it is working sign in join a meeting it all works um, and let's open Chrome, actually it's Chromium version 94 I think you will see when we open it up, it takes a while because it's a virtual machine but still here we go okay so this version of Chromium doesn't supposed to work on on XP. The last Chromium to support Windows XP is like 54 I think to 55. But if we go to about Chromium here you will see that the version I'm running is 100. It works with a few tricks here. I will show you the trick right here. So you go on the shortcut and you type this. No sandbox, force, wave audio, disable exclusive audio. You type this and it actually will work. What I have seen from my experience is that the audio on YouTube in this specific version on XP doesn't work so you might want to consider that before you install it on your virtual machine now as I said again I do not recommend by any means to use it on a mod on your main PC with Windows XP it can lead to many problems like crashes, BSODs and many other compatibility problems so how this works is actually you go to the XC you type in this specific Chrome version you go to compatibility and if you doesn't open you go to run this program in compatibility mode and this gives you a list on what operating you want to run it you can choose Windows Vista you can use uh, I recommend using Windows 7 because Windows 7 is actually a pretty good operating system and still supports Chromium I don't run this because I don't run this in compatibility mode because I didn't experience any problems but still if you want if you have if you can't open that you maybe done something wrong or even uh, didn't want to work is it's, it's you have to be lucky to get to work on real hardware. I was only 
lucky ones. So thank you for watching. I will do I will soon do a tutorial on how to install this on Windows XP. Again, I do not recommend this to use it on your main Windows XP setup. Peace guys.